Everyone has a story about porridge. A lot of ritual and nostalgia surrounds porridge. Mine began with my mum. It was a simple affair, watery oats and a little bit of brown sugar, but with five kids it was a perfect way to start the day. My name is Alex Lee Hutchinson and I run a cafe called 26 Grains in Covent Garden. I live in Hackney and 26 Grains is my first cookbook. I spent a year abroad in Copenhagen as a part of my degree. I loved it there, I loved the quality of life, cycling around the city, the smell of freshly baked bread. This was something that resonated with me, and this sense of quality and community, and how effortless and creative they were with their food. Hugger is a Danish word. It doesn't have a literal translation in English, and it evokes a feeling of comfort, warmth, coziness. And I remember feeling that first sensation of hugger in the middle of winter in Copenhagen when I wrapped my hands around a bowl of porridge. When I returned to the UK, I was so excited by the food scene. I became determined to find out more about different types of grains, the soils they are grown in, the different tastes and textures of the individual grains. So from there, the seed of the idea grew. I decided to try out something so simple and see if anyone out there was interested, and they were. Then began as a small pop-up in Old Street Station. After a year, we came across this shed in Neil's Yard, Covent Garden. It was dark and damp, but the history of independent traders and community just felt like the perfect place for us. Writing this book has been an amazing opportunity to explore the different types of grains in more depth. I feature nine grains in this book, and it's everything from the obvious to something a little bit more unknown. Amaranth, barley, rye. Some of the recipes draw on what I learned when I was in Copenhagen. Some have been created out of times of tiredness or exhaustion, and others have been in pure excitement when wanting to cater for friends and family. What I've learned is that food is more than just the flavor. It's about the people you cook the food with, who you cook it for, the music that's playing, how you set the table, it's everything. And of course, it's about the taste.